Hi, I'm Beth with 50 Plus Beauty and I'm excited that you're here with me today to shop the Rouge Beauty Insider Sale. Yes, that's right. Yesterday the sale started and I'm going to be showing you all my favorites for the sale. This is a great time for you to stock up on new things you're curious about, but especially those items that you're out of and that you know you'll need. Here's how it works. Between now and September 3rd, the Rouge members can shop and they get 20% off. And then from August 30th through September 3rd, the Rouge VIB and the Beauty Insiders get 15% and 10% off depending upon your level. And there's a link below for you to join the Beauty Insiders level if you're not yet a member of the Sephora Club. So the discounts range from 20% down to 10%, but all in all, it's a wonderful sale. Now I'm going to be showing you all of my favorites and the things that I will be buying at the Sephora Beauty Insider Sale. But first, if you're not a subscriber, I hope you'll click that little bell. It's a great way to keep up with my videos because you just receive email notifications when I post a youthing video. Okay, the first item that I'll be stocking up on is the Smashbox Photo Finish Pore Minimizing Primer. I have tried about 20 different primers since I came to YouTube about a year and a half ago, and bar none, this is my absolute favorite primer. It minimizes pores, it glides over fine lines and wrinkles, it just makes your foundation look lovely. And I've also been trying out a lot of foundations, I have like 30 in front of me there, but out of all those foundations, the absolute best one that I absolutely love is this Too Faced Peach Perfect Comfort Matte Foundation. It is a matte foundation, as you can tell, but it still allows a little bit of that glow of natural skin to kind of come through, and it really does cover up any imperfections, which I really do like a more full coverage foundation. And I would say this is a medium to a full, and it is buildable. It absolutely gives you a wonderful peaches and cream complexion, and it wears all day long. Next, I'm going to be getting into my eyeshadow palette favorites, and all four of these are my obsession eyeshadow palettes at this point, and I've been using them like crazy. The first is this Tarte, and it is the Clay Play Volume 2, and look at this, absolutely beautiful. It has the warmer shades and the cooler shades and these wonderful highlight shades, absolutely wonderful. No matter what your skin tone, these eyeshadows would totally complement you. And then there's a very natural looking blush here and then a pinker tone blush and a little bit of a highlighter. And I absolutely love these Tarte blushes because they go on and they stay on all day long. This is a fabulous eyeshadow palette. Now another palette that I've been reaching for again and again is this Too Faced Natural Eyes palette and you've seen it in other videos of mine because I absolutely love this one. It comes with a little instruction booklet which I really like and as you can tell I'm using the heck out of this thing and I absolutely love this as a beautiful brow highlight shade and this is the perfect lid color or this depending upon your skin tone. My absolute favorite crease shade probably across every palette I own is this Cashmere Bunny shade absolutely the perfect warm. It's not cool, it's not warm, it's just a perfect shade there for your crease. And then I've been loving this Sexpresso and it's what I have on now and I use that basically as a lower shadow liner with a tiny Sephora brush to put that on. Absolutely love that. This is the perfect set of neutral shadows. Now one of my favorite shadow formulas of any of them is the Smashbox formulas. These are the photo finish shadows. They last all day, they're blendable, they're gorgeous, they're true to color. And this is the Smashbox Full Exposure Palette. And again, it has this wonderful little explanation sheet, which I really appreciate that. And this one happens to come with a mirror and a fabulous brush. It's really not a bad brush at all. And as you can see, one half is the warmer shades and the other half is the cooler shades. Wonderful brow shade, wonderful lid shade, some really nice glimmery shades. They look more glimmery than they really are though because I wear them and I am 50 plus, we will say and they're absolutely fabulous lid shades with a little bit of shimmer. And then there's several good crease shades. This is just a fabulous eyeshadow palette, and I liked it so much that I bought the little travel size version of it, and I carry this around with me. In fact, no matter what eyeshadow I put on in the morning, this is kind of the shadow that I use if I need to touch up in the rest of the day. Again, this is the Smashbox Full Exposure, but it is the travel size version. And if you can only get one, I think this is a really good one to get too. These shades are absolutely beautiful. This is an edited version of the larger palette, and I think it's $20 or $25. It's very, very reasonable. And you can see how much I've used these. Great brow shade, great lid colors here, wonderful transition shades, absolutely beautiful eyeshadow palettes, a great travel palette too. Now the next two products I'm going to show you are two Laura Mercier face powders. 
And the first is the Translucent Loose Setting Powder. And actually, I was sent this powder, however, I ordered it from Atoli because I already use the same powder and I love it. And I told them when I ordered it that this is like my favorite powder ever. And quite honestly, I just wanted a free version of it because I use it so much. In fact, a day doesn't go by really that I don't use this Laura Mercier powder generally. And I'll show you how it works because I noticed that I'm getting a little bit, a little bit greasy there. Okay, I'll just take off the lid and put a little bit in there. And then I'll just take my large fluffy brush, and this is a Signa large powder brush. I'll just dip in there, and I'll come in here, and I've got to get my mirror so I can see what I'm doing. Okay, let me just kind of put the powder on, smooth it out there. The phone just rang. <laughs> Sorry about that. But you see, what it does is it nulls out the shine. It also kind of blurs out the fine lines and wrinkles. And I think the blurring effect powders are really important as we get to be a little more grown up. Now the next powder I'm going to be showing you, I also use almost every day. And this is the Laura Mercier Secret Brightening Powder for Under Eyes. And how it works is that you use a small under eye brush, something like this, and you put it on just under your eyes. And I've already put this one on, so I'm not going to put it on again for you. But it does give you that just little bit of brightness under your eyes, and it doesn't settle into fine lines and wrinkles. I absolutely love this powder because I've been looking for a concealer that gives me a little bit of a brightening accent and I haven't been able to find it, but this powder really does accent your under eyes in a positive way. Now, next I'm going to be showing you a mascara that I absolutely adore, and this is the Stila Huge Lash Mascara. Oh, Extreme Lash Mascara, that's what it is. And I have it on right now. In fact, I've been wearing it every day for probably the last six to nine months. Absolutely love this mascara. It thickens up your lashes and lengthens them too. In fact, I think it almost gives you a false lash look, and I really appreciate that. Now this last one I debated about showing you. I absolutely love this. This is my go-to everyday lipstick. In fact, my go-to lipstick period. This is the Charlotte Tilbury Revolutionary Matte Lipstick in, what is it called? Pillow Talk. That's it, Pillow Talk. And I'll put it on again for you. Love this, and I have it linked below. Right now it is sold out at Sephora, and so I will try to find another link for you if the Sephora link shows you that it's still sold out. I think this is a nude tone that about anyone can wear. Now the last three products are beauty tools and they're all by New Face. I actually purchased this product about a month and a half ago. I will link a video that I did below where I bought a fake New Face. So if you're going to buy a New Face, please buy it from an authorized dealer because I learned the hard way that you, you can get scammed. But basically I have been using this for about the past 40 days and I'm making the video this afternoon showing you my 30 day results and I think they're really fantastic. It only takes about five minutes a day and I've used it every day for the past 30 days and I think it's really tightening and toning my skin. This is not an inexpensive item. I think it's about $325, but to me it's worth it to keep the jowls up where they belong. And if you're not a subscriber, I hope you'll subscribe and click that bell because then you'll be notified when I post my 30 day results video. And again, I think the results have been pretty incredible. And for all of you out there who are interested in possibly purchasing this, it's a wonderful time during the Sephora Instagram sale to get a good percentage off and I've got a link below. Now the next item I have is the New Face Trinity Eye and Lip Attachment and I have not started using this yet but that will be a video that you'll be seeing down the road because I plan to do a video of this and then do a 30-day results video and this is to lift up those hoods and Angie of Hot and Flashy says this really really works and she swears by it and apparently also it's a wonderful lip attachment for all those little wrinkles that we can tend to get around our lips and again, if you're interested in trying this, there's never been a better time than during the Sephora Beauty Insider sales. Now the last item I'll be showing you is the new body toning device. And again, this is a little bit pricey, but I did read the reviews online and they were phenomenal. The reviews on the Sephora website, I think there were eight five-star reviews and everyone just loved it. And this is wonderful for firming up the skin and apparently getting rid of the look of cellulite. And I will tell you that unless you're going to be consistent using this, it's probably not a good purchase for you because everyone online was saying that it took two to three to four weeks to start seeing results and that you really did need to use it every day at first and then three times a week after that. And of course, if you stop using it, your results can, can dissipate. So it's important to be committed to using this. But if you'd like to investigate this further, I do have a link below. And again, please subscribe if you're interested in seeing my results because I'm going to be doing a 30-day results video.
Well, that was a look at all my Sephora faves and the items that I'm going to be repurchasing at the Sephora Insider Sale. Well, certainly my Peach Perfect Foundation is getting a little low and I'm going to be repurchasing that. And I'm going to be repurchasing my Stila Mascara for sure. Now, I always like to leave you with a little thought for the day and today is no exception. I'll be reading from these Power Thought cards from Louise Hay. Let's see what Louise has in store for us to think about today. Here we go. Ooh, a long one. Everything I touch is a success. Everything I touch is a success. And I guess these are affirmation cards. I now establish a new awareness of success. I know I can be as successful as I make up my mind to be. I move into the winning circle. Golden opportunities are everywhere for me. Prosperity of every kind is drawn to me. Oh, friends, I totally believe in this card. I believe what we think about comes about and our words are actually little succeeds of success or failure. So friends, just for today, let's reaffirm that everything we touch is a success because when we do that, we move into the winning circle where golden opportunities are everywhere. Take care. See you next time.